Nah, I got you, fam. I got you. Back in action, there we go. Chill. Welcome back everybody to the show. I am your host as always, Jay Villain, AKA that villain Jay. And tonight we have a very special treat for you. Yes, we do. Why? Well, I think we're gonna close out the time before OTJ hits. With a look back on some of our biggest hits, um, namely the one being Boros. Yeah, uh, Boros made a big splash with this set. Of course, Boros Legion being native to Ravnica, where, uh, Karlov hits. And, um, Boros, Boros Convoke is, like, the biggest thing right now. That's, like, the biggest one. Boros Token Swarm Convoke. I said, all right, we know the basic one. I've done the basic one. How do we make it even crazier? How do we make it even worse and more powerful and more lunatic because the basic one is boring me. That's mm, your basic. You know what I mean? Uh, let's make this even crazier. And what we're going to do for that is we're going to add Delny and City on Fire to make all of our 1-1s one or 2-2s two pinging for like triple the amount of damage. Yeah, I said triple. Um, before we do that, I need you to do something for me, which is, of course, tenderly press that like button. Gently press that subscribe button. Because if you don't, if you don't press that like and subscribe button, well, you will be attacked by the like and subscribe, which you may or may not know is a YouTube werewolf who will viciously maul you and rip you apart for not liking and subscribing to the channel today. Join us on our stream every night at twitch.tv slash thatvillainj for our live streaming goodness. We would love to have you there live and in person. Yes, we would love it uh, if you would join us on Twitch or on YouTube. Hit that bell uh, and you'll be notified when we go live on YouTube. We do both. We double stream. You can see me a lot of different ways. We'd love to see you. Check out our Discord community for all the latest news, information, post your decks, post memes, anything else that you might need. Talk to me, ask questions. It's all right there in the Discord. And of course, this deck and all the other ones that I build are available down below on my Aether Hub. So if you want a copy of that, uh, if you want a copy of this deck, go to the Aether Hub link in the description below and you will find it. Um, so what are we talking about with even more Vokes? Well, you're going to see the very familiar kind of, uh, you know, Boros Convoke type of situation here. Novice Inspector, of course, the one drop that shook the world, the one drop common. Who, who thought that this would, uh, would have such a big effect on the meta? One drop Human Detective, one, two. He creates an artifact instantly that lets you draw a card or crack artifacts. So just putting two permanents down on the board is enough to really, really push things. Um, in a really fun direction right here. Because the main thrust, if you will, of the Boros Convoke deck is going to be Novice Inspector followed by Gleeful Demolition. That is going to be one red, destroy target artifact. If you control that artifact, create three 1-1 one, one red Phyrexian Goblin Creature tokens. Um, yeah, that's where things get out of control. So turn one, Novice Inspector, turn two, maybe another one drop, and then Gleeful Demolition, you have four creatures on the board by turn two. That means your Convoke ability is through the roof. Um, uh, yeah, it goes crazy. What we want to do, you'll see a lot of people then right away, they cast Knight Errant of Arrows. You can actually cast it on turn two because you'd have one free mana and uh, and four creatures, and you can instantly Convoke that uh, and put a Knight Errant 4-4 four, four, uh, four, four Knight down like immediately which is pretty wild when you think about it. Um, but I have bigger plans. I have even bigger plans. Case of the Gateway Express, yeah, that's a great one. I see a lot of people using this as removal. Uh, you could put a couple of them in there. Um, I, I say maybe put some in the in the sideboard if you want. Each creature does one damage. Uh, it's a reference to or Murder on the Orient Express, where, uh, spoiler alert for a 100-year-old book, everybody on the train kills a guy. So everybody does one damage. It was kind of a convoked... Uh, damage dealer and you solve three or more creatures attack this turn everybody gets plus one plus one be careful how you use that because if you use it incorrectly it'll make the laning not work so be careful with that that's why i don't um that's why i don't often recommend it right away uh because we do want delny to work destroy evil that's going to be your big boy removal and your enchantment removal right there um pretty simple pretty basic the other removal that i have i have lightning helix um yeah if you want to even it out sure 
Lightning Helix is just so good. The fact that it can go directly to face, it does three damage for two mana, and you gain three life, is just amazing. It's just, it's just so good. Um, removing early threats, going directly to face, any of these things are going to be really, 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 really powerful. I think that they're going to be, uh, that, that they're going to be great. So, destroy evil Lightning Helix, fluctuate them how you want, along with Case of the, Gate, uh, the Gateway Express. Um, Resolute Reinforcements, yeah, another Flash one right here. If we want tokens, this is the one to beat. One white and one, 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 human soldier, Flash one, Resolute Reinforcement enters the battlefield, create a one, one soldier creature token. Uh, hitting two creatures out on the board, again, helps our Convoke, um, our Convoke, um, strategy here. And, again, Delny, we get the trigger additional time, so we could actually get three tokens out if we, if we do. Let's talk about Delny. Also, by the way, guys, this is a soldier and this is flash. So you can play it right at the end step of your opponent's turn, immediately put them out, and it's almost like they have secret haste because they immediately come out and then you can start attacking. So part of the other strategy we're going to have with this, this is probably one of the secret geniuses of uh, the OTJ, uh, not OTJ, I got OTJ on the break, of Karlov right here. Down the Streetwise Lookout adds so much support. So, so much support for small creatures. Um... The ability to go unblocked, the ability to just double triggers. Anytime that you're doing double triggers or unblocked, those are two insanely powerful abilities um, for any time you're in magic. So I'm going to go three of Delny Streetwise Lookout. One white, two, two, two. Creatures you control with power two or less can't be blocked by power three or greater. Keep that in mind. So big creatures can't stop little creatures. And if ability of a creature you control with power two or less triggers, it triggers an additional time. What do we want with power two or less? Novice Inspector, guess what? Resolute Reinforcements, that has a power on it. Um, uh, it will trigger twice. Uh, fantastic. What's another power two or less? Sanguine Evangelist right here. One white, uh, one white and two, two one. When it enters the battlefield, create a one one black, uh, black bat creature token with flying. So as long as you're not uh, high powered on this, um, you know, if he hits, it extra creates two. And then when it dies, uh, it creates two more bats, which is extremely useful. And again, token spamming as we go. Why? Because we want to Convoke, and we also want to ping. Um, this has another great ability, which is Battle Cry. Again, be careful with Battle Cry, because if you're attacking and things go overpowered, they go with two or more, they're not going to be blocked. So you have to be strategic with how you want to add these plus ones, these Battle Cries. Battle Cry adds whenever this creature attack, each other attacking creature gets plus one. Um... So you have to be careful to not go over. If you're trying to sneak in with Delny, don't do something like Caseway, uh, Case of the Gateway or uh, Sanguine Evangelist to go over that two limit if you want to sneak in. Four war, leader, uh, four war Leaders Call. Guys, probably the best Boros card to be printed out of Karlov. One red, one black, and one. Creatures you control get plus one, plus one. Whenever a creature enters the battlefield under your control, War Leaders Call deals one damage, uh, deals one damage to each opponent. Um, fantastic. You can see why the token spam is... Uh, is so useful in this because again sanguine evangelist double triggers three damage uh, you have two of them out six damage resolute reinforcements two double triggers three gleeful demolition three damage we can just ping damage from sitting way in the back right here plus everything gets plus one plus one uh, you put two of them you might get to the dangerous territory with power two or more and you won't get the trigger so again be careful with how you're lining it up if down if war leaders call if you're gonna put down two of them make sure you're in pole position to get the kill don't overpower yourself to lose her ability you kind of have to play a balancing act of how much power do i want versus how many triggers do i need off Delny, etc etc and so forth um so just be careful we already talked a little bit about about um knight errant of eos one white four convoke four four human knight when it enters the battlefield look at the top six cards of your library you may reveal up to two cards with mana value x um or less from of them or x is the number of creatures that convoke knight errant of eos um convoke knight errant of eos put the revealed cards in your hand and shuffle so what you can do is if you convoke like three you can look for anything that's three or less delny um sanguine evangelist resolute reinforcements you can find creatures put them in your hand up to two creatures so he is very useful to, to at least do a two or probably a three to get some of the higher ticket creatures out of the top uh to convoke in and also just a heavy four four body right there with the ability um 
uh, with the ability. And guys, we're not done with Convoking. Here's the pièce de résistance that I don't see a lot of people playing, and I've never played this card, even though a lot of people have told me to. If we're going to be Convoking, if we're going to be absolutely spamming the board with a lot of small creatures to do what we want to do with, City on Fire. Yeah. Um, this is a crazy one from uh, Invasion, I think. This is an Aftermath, I think. Four red and five. That's an eight drop. However, it is completely convocable. If a source you control will deal damage to a permanent, it deals triple damage instead. Yeah, we're tripling up in here, man. Doubles, triples. That's what we want up here. So we're talking about turn three, maybe getting City on Fire off. You do Nava Inspector to Gleeful Demolition. You all of a sudden have four creatures on the board. Turn, uh, um, maybe turn, uh, after that, turn three, you maybe play something like Resolute Reinforcements or something like that off the, on an off play. If you can get to eight, you can get City on Fire right out. Guess what? War Leader's Call does triple damage now. Each time you put in a creature, it pings for three. Each one of your little creatures, yeah, one damage isn't a lot, but guess what? Guess what Delny does? If I have a swarm of tiny creatures and none of them can be blocked, well, they're all doing three damage. They're all one ones that do triple damage. Attacking with seven one ones that do triple damage, yeah, that's going to kill the other guy. That's going to kill him. That's going to knock him out. So that's going to be our secret right there. And kind of, I kind of like disguising this one in, um, uh, I kind of like disguising this one as a Boros Convoke because people are like, oh, it's Boros Convoke. I'm aware of it. It's the meta right now. Boros Convoke is what it is. All of a sudden, you put down Delny, you put down City on Fire. It's not the thing they're used to. And all of a sudden, things get way out of hand. They're not expecting it. City on Fire is doing triple, triple, triple. And they're getting ping, 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 ping. All the sources are doing triple. They're just not expecting whatever's coming next. They think they have a handle on it. They don't. So that's why it's kind of the sneaker meta. It's like, oh, yeah, I kind of understand what's happening. I don't understand what's happening. I'm dead. Uh, that's going to be the progress there. Nine planes, nine mountains, four battlefield forges, one elegant parlour, and one restless bivouac. If you want to up these, I'm not mad at you either for a little bit more double mana action right there. We were having some mana issues with this deck earlier. So I'm not even mad if you want to double up this. We want to move quick, so I don't want to overdo it. But if you feel like you need to, I understand. I understand why. Um, so we're looking at it right here. This is alchemy. It's 100% standard legal as well. There's nothing in it that won't work for both. 18 creatures, most of them humans. Uh, six instants, four sorceries, eight enchantments, 24 lands altogether, and a 2.9. Um... Uh, yeah, that's what we're looking at right there. Much more white than red right there. Um, that's what we're doing. Uh, even more Vogue, so it's a surprising one. Let's take a look at the sideways view. Vogue, I mean, you can, you can, I know it's an eight drop, but I mean, you could put it anywhere. This could be as cheap as, as anything here. Uh, errant could be as cheap as anything here. So really, that's kind of how it's compacted. Um, that's what it's looking like. The only other option I have, maybe more gateways. I do like Charming Scoundrel in this because it is a 1-1 that can sneak in and you will be able to get double the abilities off of uh, Delny um, right there. Uh, she does get the creature, she does get a treasure token that helps ramp a little bit. You can also crack the treasure token with Gleeful Demolition if you need to, if you need more treasure tokens. You get the ability to discard and draw and you also get the Wicked Roll. So I actually do like Charming Scoundrel for this one just in case. Um... And uh, so some people are saying, somebody asked me, uh, you know, a big staple of this is Immodane's Recruiter. Um, the reason that we don't want Immodane's Recruiter is we want to sneak triple damage in. If they can block us, it's not really, it's not really worth it. Um, so you could do that. You could try to just swamp them out. But the idea is that we're sneaking it. The idea is that if we have Delny, they have big blockers. We They can't block our 1-1s. The 1-1s are doing triple damage right there. So you're probably asking yourself, why not Immodanes? Well, you can put them in the sideboard if you want to try to go the more classic route. I'm trying to do a unique spicy spin on what the previous Convokes, what the Convokes out there right now are. That, But see, yeah, sir, he can make a, he can always finish a game out in, on, on his own occasionally. So, you know, that's always good. Um, so that's what we're looking like right there. Leave a comment. Tell me what you think. Are you tired of Invoke? Do you like Invoke? Do you like to play this little extra spiciness? Are you excited for OTJ? Uh, I sure am. Um, I'm going to be putting up some OTJ Theorycraft build decks. Watch out for those. I'm probably going to put up two of them. Um, let's get into it. Let's rank up those plats. Leave a comment, guys. Love to hear from you.
best thing in the world. Better than sliced bread. How many shame likes can I get out of you? We're ready to harvest our shame likes. We've been live for a half hour. How many shame likes can I get out of YouTube right now? Because we got 15 people in there and only six likes. So who, who's going to shame like? Who's going to do it? Oh, oh, we got one. There we go. All right, let's see if we can get it up. RDW forever. Uh, boom, boom. Boom, boom. Boom. All right. Yeah, if they add a holy class, I will probably play through the whole game again. Um, legit. If if they add a holy class into Diablo, I'll probably run the whole. I love holy classes, man. I was hoping that we would get that Valkyrie class that they were teasing. They removed it from the art. It looked like a spears on with angel wings. Um, that would have been my shit right there, man. That would have been my absolute fucking shit, man. That oh, that would have been awesome. Ooh, he was talking about some jawbone. Talk about some jawbone. Just a mountain symbol. Is he gonna do protection? Probably. Girl Supremacy. If I get the Black Knight... How do I get the Black Knight Sword? You keep saying, get the Black Knight Sword and offer no explanation. Now I gotta use fucking Google. You happy? You happy about that? You happy you fucking make me use Google? Huh? Y'all just keep saying, do a thing and then not explain how the thing is done. Hope you're happy, man. I really do. And I mean that. I hope you're literally a happy person and, and life is good. A chance to drop from black knights who wield the same sword, 20% chance. Or maybe found an undead bird. Catacombs. Alright, so. Let's block that one. Um, what, is it, what does it scale off of? Strength? Okay, well, I'm, I have a strength build already, so. Boom. Novice Inspector. Boom. Boom. Use up to ten humanity. Oh, the humanity. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Yep, that was that. I gotta return to it one day. I already pre-brought Shadows of the Erd Tree. Oh shit, my water. Let me go get my water, by the way. My Mardu Theorycraft coming out tomorrow, I think. goes first pilot inspector 
People hate this fucking deck. I don't know if this is going to be popular. People might, might not even watch this video because of how, uh, how hated this deck is. So I think I could do City on Fire, like, next turn. Uh, it costs 8 to get out. I'll have 5, 6, so yeah, I'll be able to get fucking City on Fire. Which is wild. Unless he's got a Flame Sweeper. If he's got a Flame Sweeper, then I'm in deep shit. No, he's got Fire Inscription. Okay. I like Electro. I, I, you know, I'm surprised that it doesn't see more play. It's a very good card. Rally at the Hornburgers. We're eating Hornburgers for dinner, guys. Rally at the Hornburgers again. Delicious, fresh Hornburgers. He's going in for the big hit. Okay, I don't think this is going to be good for him. If he's got all burns, he's got me. He's, he's got that. If he just has nothing but burn cards in his spell, it hands he's got me here. I didn't get the, uh... I didn't get the, uh, boom, 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 boom. Three. He's got lightning bolt. He's got me. Nope. Mississippi. I know that person. I've played them before. Alright, well, that was luck of the draw right there. I'm not even gonna say that was skill. The convoke was nice. I like the finisher on there. But, um, we got very lucky with that kill right there. I can't believe I'm only 1,100 gems away from getting the next, whatchamacallit. What's being played today? I've got a Boros, and I've got a Demir. I got a little bit of both. We're going to see where it takes me. I'm playing, I'm playing alchemy with no alchemy cards. So it's a standard deck. It's available to be played in alchemy or standard. It is legal in both. Um, Ops goes first, no good early plays. I don't like that. <coughs> that's that's fucking worse. Holy shit. Why not? I'll I'll keep it. Good lord. Alright. Hey, Cavern Mole. Hi everybody catch the stream. Been liking all the videos, my man. Thank you so much, bro. Duly appreciated. Um, I'm glad you liked the videos. I make them for you, specifically for you. Nobody else. All right, pass. Let's see if we can bait out that, uh, nope. Got some removal? Got something? Oh, he's just gonna play direct removal. That's lame. Direct removal's lame, dude. Don't play direct removal. That's for suckers. Boom. Boom. Delny, I think, if, unless he's playing more direct removal. I think he's gonna do poison. No, he's not. A 
up and go. Welcome to the show, Cavern Mole. Destroy. Boom. Alright. We may have too much mana in this deck, by the way. That may be the problem. No, I'm just drawing a lot. Okay, 36% chance. I'm just drawing a shitload of mana. Prop's eidetic memory. Alright, fantastic. My turn. Sanguine. Sanguinarium. Just gonna trigger again. Bang. Bang. Okay. Rusko Clockmaker. We know what to do with those, don't we, boys? You see a Rusko Clockmaker, you kill it. You don't let those live. That is the teachings. Suffer not Rusko Clockmaker to live. There we go. Boom. Alright, what's he gonna do here? Ooh, look at that crazy dude. Yep. Got him. Love Dell running with Whisper Rinker for fat damage. Yeah, did you see my little cuts? Le Petit Mort the Spree? Hey, what's up, Com? Le Petit Mort was my Orzov little guys, and everything was two or less with Delny and Whisper Drinker, and really fucked things up. It did really well. I was very happy. You see a Rusko? Listen, they used to tell GIs in World War II, you see a wire, you cut it. Doesn't matter what it is, cut a wire. You see a Rusko, you kill it. You don't, you don't let Rusko go. Same thing with Sheldred. You have the means to kill Sheldred, you kill it. You don't wait. Le petit bon. Uh, alright. This is... Eh, oh, fuck it, we'll try it. Wahala. Walhalha. Wahala? Isn't that a burger place? Wahala Burger? Maybe I'm crazy. You may be right, guys. I may be crazy. You may be right. I may be crazy. Lippity mo. Pass. Let's see if he wants to counterspell it. Nope, he doesn't have it. Boom. Whispers call. It, this calls for our buddy uh, draw a fucking card because if I don't get a red man, I'm going to lose the game. Okay, he's got three, three, three things out. Holy shit, man. Skibbity goddamn. Cyrix 3D, what's the overlay called that shows my deck stats? This is called MTG Arena Assistant, brought to you by Aetherhub. Cyrix, Cyrix 3D. All right, what's he gonna put down now? He's gonna do the Juan Ring, also known as the Juan Ring. Oh my goodness, okay. We're gonna do that. Boom. That. No attacks. Okay. So it's just not gonna give me mana. Just it's just not going to. It's just like you don't need it. You don't you don't need mana. You're good, man. Sunfall naturally. Yeah. So we're gonna quit. We're gonna quit right here because it's just not giving me mana.
Oh, because you're N3? You're N3 and he's 3D? I don't understand what you mean by that, Neptune. Do not understand what you mean by that at all. That made no sense to me. But you seem to be having a good time, so that's what's important. <clears throat> Let's take a look under the hood here, because that was some sh dog shit performance that we had. 23 men on a 29. I mean, fuck it. We'll throw another red in. Why not? You know what I mean? Um, it's about as much as I can do. Um, Le petit mot. Crixus. I'm sorry. Using my full power of my brain, that guy's name is Chade right there. I swear to God for a second I thought it said Chode. I'm not lying. Legit thought that guy his name he chose was Chode. Um, Crixus 3D. Okay. Um, I made a character in Dungeons and Dragons one time whose name was Uh, Krix Shamtov. I have no idea where I got that name from, but I got it. War leaders. One more week. Tell me about it, Lord Gypticus, the Flipticus, number one Kipticus. Tell me a fucking about it, man. Insidious roots. Quite possibly even going back to his roots. Let's put Delnay down. Dude, dude. Agatha Cell Cauldron. Rubber Maverick. Okay, if we get a mana here, I feel like we're gonna be okay. So he's gonna be able to tap, put something on him, and create a create a little guy. Boom, boom. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. So, what we're going to do is we're going to put down this. We're going to do that. Delne goes off. Delne goes off. Boom, 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 boom. And we're going to say no attacks. We actually could have used a white mana there, but we'll see. Am I too late for the shame likes? Oh, we're getting some more shame likes in. Guys, don't forget to shame like the video. Don't forget to shame like the video, everybody. So, the more powerful he gets, the less he'll be able to block these, which is kind of the point. Oh, he can sacrifice it to get rid of war leaders. Doesn't matter. The problem here is Delmi. Um, Jubilant Brawler. Boom. Uh, you can do that. Boom, boom, boom. Insidious Roots. Yeah, this is a problem. If I get a white mana, that would be ideal. Um, surveil. Nah, I think he's got his engine up and running. I do think he's got his engine up and running already, so... No, unfortunately, that sucks. Uh, yeah, that sucks. Wabango. Do that. Mm, 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 mm. Unfortunately, yeah, he's this this deck is very hard to beat once it's once it's good and going. Once it's good and going, it's very hard to beat. I don't really have anything good to, to deal with it either. So we're just gonna leave. Mex uh, Mexitarkus is uh is shame liking, as he should. Jar Werewolf, how you doing? Eat, drink. All right. Drink. Bum, 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 bum. Welcome, new people. We got a lot of new people in chat tonight. Welcome, all you guys, new guys. I hope you, I hope you become regulars here. Hope you come every night forever. Oh, we got thirty viewers. We got a lot of viewers tonight. Welcome, everybody. <clears throat> to the J show.
Jester Among Fools, how you doing, Jester? Ugh, okay, yeah, we can do that. Ops goes first. I'd sure like to go first one of these days. Um... that down to grind corn and jet to dry and grind, grind coins and gems children I mostly lurk you love the videos thank you so much man shut up and dance with me This woman is my destiny. I said, ooh, 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 shut up and dance with me. A backless dress and some beat up sneaks. You guys know fucking, who sings that? Walk the Moon? Who the fuck sings that song? He's gonna play Direct Removal, fantastic. Probably gonna swing in with that one. Oh, another Assimilator. Very nice. Alright. Oh yeah, I really want fucking OTJ, man. I'm I'm craving the OTJ. I craves it. it speaks to me. Oh, that's enough to make a man sick. Uh, it is Walk the Moon? Okay. I got it. I'm, I'm good at card. Card game. Boom. Let's do this. Boom. Boom. This, um, one. Shut up and dance. It's a good song. Okay. No blocks. I'll take three. Hit. Okay, Elegant Parlor is going to have to wait his turn. 101 one. 101 Lyalia meme deck. I have no idea what any of those words mean. Literally no idea what you mean by 101 Lyalia meme deck. Don't don't understand it. Don't know what it means. My man is, uh, he's, he's playing removal here, and it's not, it's not happening fast enough. Alright, this better be something good. Better be something good here, dude. Better have some solutions for me. Nope, he does not. He does not, in fact, have any solutions for me. Dee, 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 dee. 101... Lalia the Blade Reforged, Spirit Warrior. What fucking set is that out of? Something I've never heard of, like Legends Unleashed. Some set that released in 2005 that nobody ever fucking heard of. Oh, she had 101 power and toughness. Lalia. Blade Reforged. Yeah, I was right. It's some fucking weird set nobody has ever heard of. Or is it Khan's? D, 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 D. Big fan of my Phyrexian decks. Thank you, Threshed Out. Max Atraxas said he can come every night. Well, don't overdo it, man. Make sure you drink water if you're coming every night. You, know, you don't want to. You don't want to burn yourself out. You know. Just take it easy. You know. I know a little bit's good for you, but you can overdo it. You don't want to end up in the Schoon Cave. I want OTJ. Everybody wants OTJ, bro. Uh, everybody wants OTJ. Impassioned Orator. 
kill him. Dream of Californications. Dream of Convo Convocations. So here's the here's the issue. He could have a flame sweeper, but probably not. And I could convoke City on Fire, which is good. Um I think. No, I don't have enough red mana to convoke City on Fire. Alright, there's there's that guy. Or, or do I? I do have enough to convoke City on Fire. Yeah. Only true jank? Is he gonna smash? Triple damage. He's gonna be in for a rude awakening. He's going to be a 12 damage hit. Ooh, see? That's what I'm talking about there, man. He was going to be in for some for some serious pain. We're going in. Mmm. Destroy that. Pop, 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 pop. Draw, resolve. Land, draw, resolve. Don't be a land. Yeah, it's novice inspector. Very nice. Okay, what's he gonna put down? I hope he puts something big down so I can kill it. Oh, it's Tajik. Tajik, my dude. Boom. Calm, I'm glad you're having a good time, man. I'm having a good time, too. Boom. Let's see if we can get a plat, too, guys. Let's see if we can trick our way up the, up the ladder. Guys, did you know that I made a song? Did you know I made a rap song? Nobody knows this. So Vesky, how you doing? So Vesky, this is this is not a safe place for OTJ haters. I'ma let you know right now, Sovesky. I'ma let y'all I'ma let everybody know right now. This is if you're if you're an if you're an OTJ hater, I'm telling you, you could stay. You, you you absolutely are welcome here. But we're we're about to go really heavy into uh uh, OTJ love. Hey, what's up, buggy man, buggy man, buggy man, buggy man? As a matter of fact, let me do that. There we go. Just so you know, I'm serious. Just so you know, I'm serious. That's how serious it is. I got this so I can put cowboy hats on everything. Okay. I love that western shit. Boom. 
Oh, that's upside down now. Now it looks like the Arby's hat. There we go. We put the cowboy hat on Vito. See? There you go. It's serious over here, man. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, boom. Okay, boom, boom. Crack. War of Aos. Boom. Search. Nothing. All right. All right, now I'm going to put it back on me. Nebraska's fall. Sacrifice a creature. I'll sacrifice that one. That's fine. Doof. There we go. Blockers. Uh, yeah. Boom. Okay. We do that. We do that. Auto pay. much we need a cowboy emote we need a yeehaw well I'm moving around so it's hard to keep it on top of me drown an I core I I don't think this guy knows how bad the damage is gonna be I don't think he understands how insane the damage is gonna be I don't think he truly truly comprehends the horror Even if you don't dig the cowboy aesthetic, bro, the power levels of OTJ are awesome. The power levels, the cards, way, way more interesting than Karlov. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, negative 10. Yeah, I mean, the cards are awesome. You, you can't deny that. Even if you're like, no, nah, cowboys are stupid. Come on. The power level, man. The combos. The mechanics. Good stuff. So your best bet, I do have some anti-control mono green for Exion. Yeah, I do have some of that. Bum, bum. Why did it get so quiet all of a sudden? Everybody was talking for a while, and all of a sudden it got real quiet. Y'all tired of my convoking? Convoking, burn token. Bud smoking. Matt 33. My hat scared that. Absolutely, the hat. The hat really fucked people up. That I could tell that one fucked with people real bad. Mulligan, much better. Throw away a knight errant. Just vibing. Vibe. Kind of curious about the Demir deck. Not going to lie, what's the theme? Demir card draw. Yeah. Ah, you're playing. Yeah, I'm thinking of doing the eidetic memory prof. I, I I saw it for a while, and watch uh not um uh Trex was like, "You're doing one," and I'm like, "I'm thinking about it." Here's like, here's mine. So I 
Yeah. Ooh, Rowan fell. Very nice. If I look hard enough into the set and sun, boom, ba da da my love will laugh with me before the morning comes. Well, I can play a little bit of control, so that's the good news. Is I can throw a little bit of removal. I can um, I can throw a little bit of counter spells in there. You know, I can do. I can get silly. I can get real silly with it, which you know is fun sometimes. Sometimes you gotta get silly like Soupy Sales, you know what I'm saying? Uh, ooh, so we have... We have an opportunity here. Let's do Vampire Evangelist. Um, let's do that. feel like I can get him. Even if he burns Evangelist out, I feel like I can get him. Because I can crack that and do three damage. I don't think he's got the removal for me. Smite the Deathless. There we go. And he took a damage for it. Okay. So I feel like I can still get him, though. Herberus get four damage. Unless he's got a pump up. He could have a pump up. He could pump up the jam, pump it up. Um Monastery Swift Spear. Dream a convo kit. Yeah, I want pick two. I'll take those two. Three. I think I'm okay. Unless he has two lightning bolts and a red mana, then I'm not okay. No, he's got Godric. He can do four. Block that. Block that. Boom, boom, boom. Two. Pop. He gets a card off the top. He got two mana off the top. He's got a lightning bolt. He's ones it. Nope. All right. All right. Lucky. Close one. Real razor thin margin right there. Fun though. Most of the cards I play are from your channel, which is really enjoyable to play as. Uh, fantastic, man. I love to hear that threshold. Boom. Boom. Fucking worse opener. What is with this deck? What is absolutely with this deck, boys? Throw that shit away. You know what? Holy shit, deck. Is it me or have we got an absolute fucking dog shit draws, man? Have we just absolute got some fucking dog shit draws? It, it can't just be me. Like, I'm not crazy, right? These have been dog shit draws. 
There's been absolute fucking terrible fucking draws off the top. Like, how many times do you see a fucking just all, all of one mana? Even if I have other shit in there, and it's just, it's fucking stacked uh, the wrong mana. Like, holy shit. Oh, there we go. I was hoping something like that would happen. Um, Alright, so he's going to put down the, oh, Phyrexian Arena. Well, we'll do that. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. Boom. Do that. Put down Knight, Aaron, and Aeos. Boom, boom. Boom. Okay. Boom. Draws an extra card. And... Probably direct removal. That's fine. Okay. Doof. I'll swing in. Boom. Boom. Alright. You can draw. Boom. It might be a Sheldred. Wouldn't be surprised if it was a Sheldred. It's a one ring. We'll do that. Boom, 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 boom. Do that. He really wants those extra fucking cards. I'm worried he's gonna run uh, Gix's command or some shit. That's that's my biggest issue. Boom, boom, down to two. Yeah, if he runs Gix's command, we're pretty fucked here. We actually would win if he doesn't wipe us. Unfortunately, he can get infinite cards with one ring. Nisa? No, that's not it. That is... that's the wrong. That's... that's it. I think he knows he's gonna die. Gopher. Boom. Boom. Boom, boom. Triple. Again, we wait to see if he's going to Gix his command us. No, he's not going to Gix his command us. Going to draw on it. Draw some cards. I don't even think that's going to help. I don't even fucking think that's going to help, dude. No, it's not. Bushwhack. Boom. Bushwhack, boom. Draw. Nah, I got you, fam. I got you. There we go. Back in action. There we go. Sheldred down. Alright, guys. Alright, guys. We're going to leave it right there for tonight. Uh, not bad. It got me to plat 2. I mean, something that a lot of other decks weren't doing. So, yeah, we'll make our attack run on, on Diamond pretty soon. Hopefully, maybe in time for OTJ. Um, but fun. I, I mean, let's take the Convoke. Let's take the Convoke. Let's let's double down on it. Let's take it to the next level. Um, um, 
let's just make it even crazier you know let's 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 i've never used city on fire i've been looking for an outlet for it so let's double down on the convoke you know why not we'll have fun with it so until next time guys i've been jay villain and you've been great